Hello, this is Joe Barnes here with another quick tip and we're continuing with our mini Aweber series here and uh, on my last video I showed you this article uh, tab here. What I'd like to do in this video is quickly show you the image and the button tabs. So I'm going to hover over image and just pull this down. That's going to put this box here and if you simply just click on that box to edit it then you can actually resize the image if you want to, make it smaller or bigger. Um, and over here you can either choose the URL of an image to put in here or you can upload a file directly from your desktop so if we just go in here and find an image that we can use let's just choose that one what that's going to do is it's going to upload it to the Aweber image gallery and then what you're going to do is you're going to want to click on browse image gallery it will show you the images that you've got in here and you can just grab the one you want and it will load that up in here now that will just take a moment to load but while that is loading I want you to remember um, that most people won't have their image display button clicked on their email client so in the image alt text section you may just want to put here click you know something like click display images to see graphic or, or something like that just click display images to see graphic anything like that um, that just encourages them to actually click that button to see the images here of course you can have an image link as well which will make the image clickable from your email and here you can decide where you want the image whether you want it on the left or you want it in the center or you want it over to the right okay and of course you can resize the image uh, you can do that over here or you can simply come here and just make that image how big or small you actually want it in your page uh, and the other thing about these drag and drops as well is you can obviously move them so I can say well actually I want my image up there or below or whatever and you can have it wherever you want it in your actual page and that's it that is how you add an image to your Aweber message